Twitch star Asmongold was blown away by Black Myth Wukong and revealed why it deserves Game of the Year, even though he has one issue with it. Chinese developer Game Science's Black Myth Wukong has taken the world by storm, amassing over 2 million concurrent players, becoming Steam's most played single-player title ever. The Journey to the West-inspired action RPG has received glowing reviews since its release, as Mongold firmly believes it's the current frontrunner for Game of the Year 2024. According to the streamer, the game is a 9 9.5 out of 10 for him, with the only reason it's not a perfect score being that he wishes the game had more in the way of exploration. I wish it had more open world exploration, because of how good the game is, that I feel dumb even saying that. The mechanics in this game are incredible. They are so well done. Each of the bosses is really well designed. This is way better than what I had expected. Continued, pondering what other game could potentially beat it for game of the year, and determined that Black Myth Wukong was the clear favorite. While his chat suggested Elden Ring's Shadow of the Erdtree DLC could be a contender, as Mongol dismissed it, remarking how DLC never wins Godi. I think this is better than Stellar Blade, he added. If Stellar Blade is an 8, this is a 10, and I think Stellar Blade is a phenomenal game. However, the Twitch star reiterated that he wishes the game offered more in the way of exploration, and expressed hope that if it performs well, the devs will be empowered to make a bigger project on an even grander scale. It's so weird to see a game like this and to see how flicking amazing it is, and then compare it to other games that have been released. It's like, what are they even doing? It's insane. Given how critical Asmon has been of the games industry this year, his praise for Black Myth Wukong stands out, but we won't know if his goatee prediction comes true until December.